Hi, this is a follow-up video to my how to make an engine video and um, I've made some changes I want to show you. Thanks for all your suggestions. Many of you said I needed a exhaust port and so I drilled one right there. It's kind of small and I am prepared to make it bigger uh, but I don't know if I need to yet and that is right at the end of the power stroke. So the piston is right about here and it gets to right there when the pistons beyond here then it can vent from that hole and I may drill bigger or possibly more of them around this also some people talked about the, um, the push piston rod being too loose it was able to slop around like that so I added this piece to uh, tighten that up so it's not as sloppy um, a lot of people asked about the flywheel and said maybe it should be bigger, more massive, uh, and I think that comment was made primarily because it, the flywheel was having a hard time opening this valve, which is actually kind of hard to turn. Both of the, I had two of these valves, three quarter inch valves, and they're kind of hard to turn. Um, so what I did instead, I may still replace the flywheel, but I made these little valves, which are air uh, for compressed air, I put them in place and see how easy they are to turn and so I'm thinking the flywheel will have no problem turning those you know one explosion should kick around and open the valves for the second explosion I'm hoping and then lastly as you can see I've added a cam system um, some people pointed out that the timing was off on the engine it was opening in the wrong time and so and so this is set up now to where, well, let's just start here. Let's say this is there's top dead center. I would spark here, which I don't have it hooked up yet, but I would spark here. It would fire over around the top like that. That's combustion. And then exhaust right there. And then the cam, which I've just taped a large piece of foam on the outside of this wheel to make a cam, it seems to work. And it pulls on, it pushes on this wheel which pushes on these wires that open these valves. But right here, just past, I guess you'd call that bottom dead center, um, this pops these two valves open and they, it holds them open for the whole cycle that this is going back and then finally lets go and then it's ready to spark again right there. So you have explosion all the way out there, exhaust, then intake the whole time back again explosion exhaust intake and here I am trying to run it again and you'll see it just doesn't work very well at all almost worse than it did before I'm still trying to figure out I don't think I'm getting oxygen for some reason but we'll see so I'm going to go ahead and cycle it through the intake which opens these valves should be filling the cylinder come back around to right there and then I should then I would spark it and I'm getting nothing so obviously I need to figure out why I'm not getting gas in here um, work with it some more but if you have any ideas or comments on what I've done so far please let me know thanks a lot